Okay. Here we got your standard tea candle. The tiny little burned out wick in it. And here's a tea candle that I pulled out the wick. And I replaced it with some of this bigger heavy stuff here. Call it medium bleached candle wicking. This burns a lot hotter. And uh, does a little better job. Now for the boat. This is the essence of simplicity. A coil. 3 64ths copper. Coiled around. Comes out under the boat. Epoxy in place. I didn't see any real reason for those things to protrude beyond the back of the boat because it might be in the way of a rudder if I want to put one in later on. Um, but anyway, there it is. Super simple. Um, now we're going to go over here and fill it up with water. Put on the, just a light stream. Put it on one tube until you see it coming out the other. It doesn't take much. And we hold it up. Put it in our little test basin here. And I want to light this. Set this camera down. I'll light this candle. See that or not, and stick it in the boat. And there we go. Right away. Look at that. Oh, had a little burst there. There we go. She's getting into it now. You can see. Oh, need to pull that can just a little bit further underneath. There we go. And it's off like a bat out of hell. You can see it's moving about uh, one mile, and about a half mile an hour or something. It doesn't make any appreciable noise. Um, but it works, Alan. How about that? It's not a pop-pop boat. It's a stealth boat. Sardine runner. Oh, the Sardine Express. This runs at night, bringing in rotten fish. <laughs> that would be the miracle. Okay, so there you go. The proof is in the pudding. doesn't get any simpler than that. <laughs> I put the candle and the whole thing so it would be back a little bit so that the bow of the boat is up because if I feel like it, I might even make a kind of a fancy little front part on it and make it look like a barge or something. Paint it up. And uh, maybe they'll put it on the cover of Popular Mechanics. Who knows? Anyways, it looks like with that tea can, I get quite a lot of miles per gallon of paraffin. And this is a Florida tea candle. It's Cetronella. So if you're out playing and there's mosquitoes around, not only can you play with your boat, but you'll chase the mosquitoes away. Off the